Now we're live. Now we're live. Okay, I, it's, I started chatting to myself because it said we were live and then it said it didn't go live. YouTube's weird. YouTube's weird. Okay, cool. Right, done. I can, right. Hi. Hi, YouTube. Forever an enigma. Welcome back to some Dark Souls Pyromancy only. This is, this is How to Souls. My name is Rach. How to Souls is my baby. My actual baby is down there. She's, um, she's sleeping. She's sleeping just over there beside the door. <laughs> Hi, doggo. Hello, all the early crew. Uh, we have a Vicky and an Aaron and a GRH and hopefully I'm coming through okay because I was talking for like some minutes and then it, I noticed that OBS had a little bubble saying that I wasn't actually coming through. So that's fun. <laughs> I don't know. I just I just think I'm a Twitch girl. Imagine imagine wearing this hoodie. Hi little. Hello. Yeah, Evie's here. I'll set up Evie cam. Well, set set up Evie cam so we can have Evie cam. Uh, hi Paul! Welcome in! Hello, hello! Welcome back to How to Souls. We're doing Pyromancy only. It's actually really easy. I've been playing a lot of Dark Souls 1 lately. I'm actually so out of practice with Dark Souls 1. It's hilarious because we were doing poorly translated over on Twitch. Um, so all the things that we're about to do tonight I've literally just done but in a different build. Right, let's get Eevee. There's the baby. There's the baby. So she'll just be over at our soul count. Nothing important there. Just the souls. <laughs> Hi, Mickey. Okay, all right, Aaron can hear me. That's all we need. Dog dog, the flipping rusted iron ring just became dog dog for some reason. I don't know. I, I don't know. <laughs> but yes, welcome back. My head has been so full of Dark Souls lately. I was recording more of the Dark Souls 2 walkthrough. That was a fantastic time. Evie is so cute. I know. She's so happy to be back. She was at my mum and dad's, Eric, for the past two nights. And now she's back. She's so excited. She was like, she greeted me at the door. Her tail was wagging. She was she was barking. It was so cute. Right, so it's been a wee while since we did the last YouTube live stream. I've moved house. I'm in Scotland now. It's woo! It's great. Um but I've forgotten what we were doing. So we have seven achievement slots. Holy cow. We have uh, Power Within, Combustion, Great Combustion, Fire Orb, and Great Chaos Fireball. <gasps> cool. And it looks like we were just about to go into ONS. Brad, hello. Hello, hello. I always think when I <laughs> when I say that, it's a back kittoism. I don't know if anyone else noticed that. But I the way I go, Brad, hello, is that is because that's what Bat says. Hello. And I've just watched too much Bat Kittle. Uh, and I've just adopted that. How's the floor? The floor is amazing. Oh my god, wait. Oh, I put it in I put it in Patreon, but I didn't put it in Pleb Chat. Flip, let me get you a pick of the floor. There's the floor. If you can see, it's like a grey vinyl. Uh, my kitchen is finally incredible. She does ring the Hello! I can uh Scottish people I can do quite good impressions of. Like I, I can do a really good posh shark. I can do a good back kill. Uh, so once again, this is pyromancy only, so I'm gonna have to like shift my brain because I was playing Dark Souls 2 uh, with like power stance maces earlier. So I'm very much like in the melee mentality. It looks amazing. It's honestly, it's so beautiful. You need to hear the posh shark. Well, as it turns out, GRH, Mr. Posh Shark has this very fantastic way of speaking where he actually speaks quite slowly and he takes quite big pauses in the middle of speaking and now I don't know if that's just because he's a very intelligent being and he just wants to think about what he wants to say next so instead of doing what Rage Quit does and does uh, every two seconds Mr. Posh Shark sits and thinks about what he's going to say I'd love to Posh to read to me <laughs> aww Posh is such a dad man Okay, we're gonna do the skip and we're literally just gonna go around here. Oh, or we're gonna fail. Or we're gonna fail. Let's do it. So we run around here and then we just go, boop, I have got a video. <gasps> oh, talking about how to do that and how to do it properly. <gasps> bean jumping, hello. I had a, I had a beans, cheese and bacon roll 
for lunch, Benjamin. Hello, Leo! I have punk- Oh my god, Flip! Yes, Vicky! I forgot about that. I was like, I'll ping, I'll ping. Um, but I, I forgot. Thank you very much. What a good mod. What a good mod. Head packs. What a good mod. Uh, so we don't need the blacksmith because we're pyromancy only. We don't need the blacksmith. Uh, well, we just go ahead and like go down here because we can just do that jump every time we die. Uh, I'm human. Oh, my black eye orb is quivering. That could be fun. Doing a bit of the black eye orb. I will do it after ONS, I think. A fall shorter than that killed me in Dark Souls 2 the other day. <laughs> I love Dark Souls 2. Right, we're gonna open up with the big guns. We're gonna do, we've got great combustion. Uh, I don't really wanna be nice and close to these guys. That feels quite loud. Is it loud? It feels loud. Yeah, I'm just gonna hang back. We'll throw the great chaos fireball. Uh, I think we'll just go for Smo. Like, Smo is a bigger target. Oh, he's gonna charge, he's gonna charge, he's gonna charge. Okay. Right, yeah, Smo's a bigger target. That clipped me. Right, go here. We can get Ornstein actually. I think Smo has less fire resistance. Right. Okay, we're in good position now. Nice damage! Okay, he didn't say- <gasps> Ornstein hit the, uh... Ornstein hit the puddle. I wanted Smo to stand in the puddle. puddle. Hi, Michael! Welcome in! We're getting started, like, right away today because... We got loads of bosses to do. We got loads of bosses to set on fire. Oh my god, I'm just getting battered! Killed Super Ornstein with most- and this is so loud for me! It's too loud, jeez. Hi Tom, welcome in! Yeah, so yeah, Ornstein wouldn't be too bad with Pyro, hanging out underneath and using- Yeah, that's what I'm thinking, so like, I'm gonna save Great Combustion for phase two. Hi Ball, welcome in! How are you guys doing? How was your Thursday? Your Thor's day? I've been up since the crack of dawn, doing, um, doing house stuff. Oh, also we have Power Within! I forgot about Power Within! That's what we should do and just try and get like some great damage right off the bat. Oh, he plonked it! <laughs> he plonked it. Yeah. Mate. Mate. That was really quiet. <gasps> I'd work. Blah. Blah. I've been working all day. I've been making, let's see, what did I make? I made um, two Cult of the Lamb edits and I made, I recorded two. I recorded two Dark Souls 2 walkthrough segments. Literally, Forest of Fallen Giants was like two hours worth of recording. I had so much to say. I had I just I just love to talk apparently. But Dark Souls 2 just at the start, there's lots to talk about. Okay, audio level's good. Okay. Uh, or sounds more were way too loud for me. Um I hope they're not too quiet now. That would be really awkward. <laughs> But yeah, today flew by. Same, Brad, same. It's good though, it means we were busy. Um, it's because you graduated yesterday. That's what it is, Brad. Now that you're a graduate, time just like runs away from you. Okay. Right, let's go for school. Charge me there, flip. Walk into it, walk into it, walk into it. Nice! Oh, you didn't need charge. I'm being really aggressive here. Oh, yes! Okay, I was like, I couldn't see the bolt, and I was like, when's the bolt coming? Oh, I've got Disney to play! Oh, I thought about playing Disney tonight, but I'm gonna, after Dark Souls, I'm gonna go to bed and play Pokemon, I think. I've been missing Pokemon. Where's Smo? <laughs> he doesn't ever want to 
stand in the in the puddle. Can't target him. Okay, get him. Oh! I don't know what hit me there, the bull or the oh no. Hi Ernstein! Where have you been? Oh I'm out! I'm out! I'm out! Oh! Okay, I think I've got fire arms as well. Right, fire arm. Oh, that hit the hammer. Okay. How to souls? <sighs> got some more spooky stuff in Disney. I don't really understand how Nikki was getting so many of the little blue orbs, like to level up the season pass. I don't really know how she was doing that. Because I only found like one chest that had like 10 in it. But I want all the spooky stuff. Okay, Mega Arnstein. Uh, I got a lot of practice with <gasps> balls. <laughs> yeah, I got a lot of practice with balls. Yeah, I did. Uh, I got loads of practice with Mega Arnstein when we were doing rolling only. Um, that doesn't mean I'm like super good at him though. Oh, he can. Oh, hang on. He can bug here. He was still charging. No, I thought he was going to continue charging. Should we do. um? Be power within. Are we feeling ballsy? Yeah, let's go. Oh, 500 damage on Mega Arnstein. Is he gonna butt drop? Are you stabbing? Oh. Let's pick this up. It's in the way. In the way. Hi Thomas! Hi Caddy! Welcome in guys, how you doing? Welcome back to Hide to Souls where we play lots of Dark Souls. I'm doing Pyromancy only so I'm like only allowed to... Uh, only allowed to Pyromance! Uh, and that was our second try on Orange Sign and Smoke. Not bad! Not bad! Uh, it's less than a month until Scarlet and Violet. I'm so excited. I'm gonna play. Um, I'm gonna play more Arceus. I've been trying to get 100% on the Pokédex. Bobby, wait. <laughs> uh, Thomas spent most of the morning looking at Parcel Force's tracking page and then saw that there was postal strikes. Oh. I better get the Steam Deck tomorrow. Oh, Cam, hi. <laughs> Um, yeah, I am also waiting on something coming in the post. I'm waiting on some postage stamps coming in the post so I can post off some more things. But um, yeah, oh, well, if there was a strike, then that explains that. I've been waiting for them since Tuesday. The event goes on for like 30 days and she's already got all the stuff. I don't know, like, how do I, how do I get the stuff? How do I get the stuff? I don't get it. I should play more, that's it. That's that's it, how, that's how you get stuff in Disney, just play more. <laughs> how are you doing, Kanu? Uh, Michael saying, what was Smo's poorly translated name? Oh my god, get this, get this. It was Dragon Slayer Ornstein and Beautiful Craftsman. It just didn't touch Ornstein, but 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 Smo was Executioner Smo became Beautiful Craftsman. <laughs> uh, what we level in, guys? I guess most of my souls kinda needs to go to my um flame. Dear Flame. Flame, dear Flame. That's that's Dark Souls 3, isn't it? Um, what have we got? We've got it at plus 14. So plus 15 would get it to like the max that we can get it before we have to ascend it. And I'm sure when you ascend it, you need like loads of souls. Um, so I'll just hang on to my souls for now. Why have I only got one ring? What's my ring situation all about? What, what guys, what's happening to my ring? Oh, it was two? Ah, oh, that's uh, Macduff. Not to fetch a new ember, flame. Dear flame. <laughs> Poshy, hello. Hello, hello. We weren't doing impressions of you earlier. You use moonstone to buy event currency. Moonstone. I don't know what moonstone is. It's like in her eyes. I swear, she's got big boobies. She's got big boobies. Uh, counter attack, critical attacks, no. Uh, extra, extra castings would be good, but half HP. I mean, have you seen how clumsy I am? <laughs> we can maybe do that for our miracles only, that'd be good. Uh, Traverse Abyss, uh, yeah, so that'll be why I only have one ring on because I literally don't have anything else uh, to, to, to do. 
<laughs> Taking a family trip out to Mrs. Shark's work to use the toilet. Oh, it's it's it is really hard having to live with uh, one room of your house out of commission. Um, it's why Mike and I ended up going out for dinner early. Uh, yes, last night because we like didn't have a kitchen, so <laughs> it's hard. I find it really like interesting that you guys only have one bathroom, like one toilet in your house, because I have like three. So if you want one of mine. I would really rather not have to clean three. Like, I don't need three. Like, Poshy has a whole flippin' oh, you got family of four? Like, can you please, can I just mail you one of my bathrooms, please? <laughs> you can clean it instead of me. <laughs> uh, so let's like level up, so I've got 20, 31. 31's an odd number, why did I go for 31? Was it 31 to get seven slots, maybe? Uh, okay, okay, yeah, I think I'm gonna try and hold on to this 55. If I lose it, that would suck, but uh, I don't know, I'm pretty good at video games. I don't know. So, uh, I always recommend doing Lost Isolith first, um, but that's actually not gonna be very good. That's not gonna be very good at all for us. I have no idea how we're gonna do we have to do we have to skip centipede demon we have to we can't we can't do centipede demon because he is immune to fire um and we could skip demon fire sage as well if i'm not mistaken yeah because that's where the the shortcut is down it's right before the door for um demon fire sage you go down the route but you need so that's 30 humanity we might have to humanity farm just because I cannot fight centipede demon. Ooh, that's quite interesting. Like, I, I've never, like, skipped him because I have to before. I've only skipped him, like, I don't know, wanting to save Slayer. Yeah. I'm willing to manually flush a pee pee, but not a poo poo. <laughs> I don't think I've ever lived anywhere with more than one bathroom. I would just like one, or maybe two. The ensuite. <gasps> Ensuite is so good. I love it. I love it. It's so good. Although the shower was leaking, so that's not good. <clears throat> Where did that go in? Oh, yeah, uh, sorry. <laughs> the other half of my sentence was usually I would recommend doing Isolith first, but um, we're going to go and do a um, uh, Jukes. Paul is said to be susceptible to poison. Oh, that could be worth looking up. Um, and if he is, I might have. Oh. If he is, then I have to kill him because we had to do Quelag with Mildred. Like, cause Quelag, I just couldn't, there was no way I could get uh, anything to take down Quelag cause her toxic resistance was like massive. Cause we've got like poison mist, three uses. Is there a toxic version? Did I framped her cath? Did I framped her cath? I haven't done either. Have I talked? Did I talk to Frams? Doesn't really matter. I mean, Cast just gives you the the invasion coming in and the dark hand, which I'm not going to use anyway. I mean, I will at one point on some on one playthrough. This character, I'm planning on doing a run using every weapon. Uh, that's why I called her Absolute Weapon, <laughs> which is an insult in Glasgow. Uh, okay, we rest here. I'll kill her at some point. Oh, if I can, if, if Centipede is weak, not weak, if Centipede is decently susceptible, then we're going to have to kill it because we can't skip bosses on challenge runs. We have to kill all bosses. That's that's part of the fun. Um, but if he has massive toxic resistance, then it's impossible. Oh, no, actually, I think you can summon Solaire. I think you can get Solaire, yeah, for a Centipede. <gasps> that changes everything. I can get him for Demon Fire Sage though. But Demon Fire Sage is not immune to fire. I think he's strong against magic. But I don't think he's immune to fire. Oh, I need to place the vessel for the. Pff, I'm such a pleb. Centipede Demon is weak to solar. Oh, yeah, we could do that. We could do that. Let me, um, let me have a look. So. Cern to purge. Cern to Oh my god, Cern to purge. Oh, Evie left. Nobody said. <laughs> uh, let's have a look. 
a large bug-like creature which drops the uh, what was the orange charred ring? It was like flower or something. Where do I find your resistances? It's immune to fire, yeah, I knew that. <clears throat> Susceptible to magic and lightning. I mean, my pyromancy, I don't get magic or lightning. It doesn't say that it's not weak to toxic. Okay, so is there a toxic mist? I think there is. Is it Engi? <gasps> we maybe have to go and get egg. Toxic mist. Is it Engi? Engi. I can never say. I'd say Engi. Yeah! Oh, we have to get egg, guys. That's fun. Let's do that. We have to try. Uh, it's only got one use, which means we're definitely using the um the 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 laurel. Not the laurel. Sorry. The um. I've got the laurel. This thing, the dust crown ring. Egg! <laughs> we have to go beat egg. Right, this is out and I'd quite like to fix that, but um... Oh, I should have done that while we were there, huh? I should have done that. We can warp back. Okay, so we give this to Frampt, or we wrap Frampt takes us to the kiln. Egg. <laughs> it's a bad day to be a giant with a crotch in Lord Ran. Well, I'm just gonna set it on fire. Oh uh, man, see, I just did this the other day, but it was poorly translated. And now hearing the normal translation, it just does, it's not the same, man. It just hits different. Okay. This is the Fire Link Chamber. And of course, if at any point, if you're watching this, maybe like right now, live or in the future, and you didn't realize that I actually have a full, very comprehensive, and I don't skip cutscenes and stuff, uh, walkthrough on this channel. Uh, so you can check that out. Or you can subscribe and watch it later if you're enjoying the stream and stuff like that. But yeah, my Dark Souls 1 walkthrough is pretty good. And I'm working on filling a lot of the gaps. Because it does have a couple gaps. Like, for example, I don't do Great Hollow. I don't do... Um... Oh, I did do Painted Worlds. Yeah, I don't do Great Hollow. And I don't do, like, some NPC quests. And stuff like that. <laughs> Hi, to Souls. That's us. Okay, so we'll go back to... We'll do the... Um... Yeah, let's go get Firelink Bonfire back. Because it's... It's a pain not having it. Um, also, it could be a good idea to do, uh, mm, I don't really want to do Tomb of the Giants without, can I, like, you've got cast light, now that's a sorcery, it's, it's weird that there's not, like, a pyromancy version, I get why there's not, but, It'd be cool if we could like use pyromancy to light up the tomb of the giants because what i'm thinking is it would be really good to get the the pinwheel the wheel of pins right hopefully my orb quivers before this guy attacks me uh it might only quiver when i go in the room i need to go in the room <sighs> Ugh. Okay, it quivered, it quivered, it quivered. Right. Yee! Okay, searching for the world of the guilty. Invading the world of the guilty. Okay, I haven't done this in a long time. I remember it being really hard. It was not a very bright idea. Wait. <laughs> so our options for lighting up Tomb of the Giants. One, Rach could just get good and learn how to navigate it in the dark. That would really set me up for life. Like, just being able to do that. Not having to... To, to do... To do Lost Isleth every time I want to do Tomb of the Giants. Um, okay, well, I've lost half my health. I could get good. Dave, hello! Hello, hello! Love a quivering black orb on a Saturday night, but it's Thursday. It's Thursday, though. <laughs> uh, I think Great Chaos is going to do really well as long as I can get it in before I get like hit by the caster or whatever. I think, I think they're just gonna like stand in it. Well, look at you. I you were 69. That was a, that was a bit less whelming than I thought it was gonna be. I thought it'd be like more whelming. Towards a flame. 
Oh, I got him! He stood in it! He just stood in the fire! Have you guys ever played World of Warcraft? Get in! Oh! As, I mean... <clears throat> as I expected. Great Chaos Fireball was very, very effective against Lauterek. So if you have lost your bonfire in, in Firelink Shrine, all you have to do is just that. That's all you have to do. That's how you souls. <gasps> we got her soul back d immediately. Also, we have two fat. How the fuck? We have two fat. No, we don't have a fat. Now we have one fat. My other playthrough. My other playthrough had a fat. This is a new fat. <laughs> <laughs> that did 300 on a tick which is insane uh right cool immediately immediately once you do that just 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 homeward boner go back to firelink right go back to firelink don't talk to anyone else don't talk to the bronze lady don't talk to the fair maiden do not do not trade in that firekeeper soul because this game is so mean and it doesn't label it differently. It's literally just Firekeeper Soul. It will stack with other Firekeeper Souls that you have. So just immediately once you get it. Um, can, I, can I work to Firelink from here? I think I can. I don't think we have to go via France. Hi. Just go back and hand it in. We've all made that mistake. Where we've turned Anastasia into an Estes Flask or a Stretch. Hang on, what's it called now that I've got it at plus four? It's something, it was It was less impressive than Stretch. My pyromancy brings all the Elden folk to the yard and they're like, did you cleanse another dark soul today? Damien, hello. <laughs> I think you could use Firestorm at the wall in Lost Isolith where the bugs are and it might kill the one on the other side. <gasps> that would be cool for saving Solaire, but I need to go and loot it, Mick, to get the, uh, to, to get the hat. I need the hat. That's the problem. Yeah, great great chaos is great. Love it. Okay, let's go. Right, handing this in. Handing this in. And then we're doing... Place the Lord Vessel. Got the cutscene, did that. Return five people's soul. Right, she's back. She's she speaks now. Yeah, no, that's okay. It was a good, it was a good suggestion for saving Solaire, for sure. Thank you. I'm Anastasia of Astora. Now I can continue my duty as a keeper. But I only hope that my impure tongue does not offend. She's so cute. Um, but yeah, we didn't have a, that was the only thing we had. Uh, so yeah, she's back, which means that she's back taking care of the bonfire. The bonfire is back. Everything's back. She's the best. Yay. Right. 60,000. Uh, that is enough to get to 15. So let's go do that at Thingy Mabobby here. Oh, hello there. You've been Why? Tell me. That. Uh, no. I'm sorry, sir. I cannot tell you where I got this great chaos fireball. Do not tell him. It's kind of mean and he gets kind of sad, but pff, he'll get over it. If you tell him where it is down in the swamp, he goes down in the swamp looking for it. He goes insane. He dies. He goes hollow. So you lose him. So no. Sorry. We're not friends. <laughs> You're a tool. <laughs> In any case, I definitely trust you. Sorry. Yeah, you yeah, just trust me. Yeah. Forget that I said anything. Yeah, I'm sorry. I had to, like, tell a little white lie. Just, like, had to hurt him a little bit to help him a lot, you know? Right, modify equipment. Paramancy Flame, 15 was 25k. That's cool. So now we can get it to go higher than that. But it needs to be ascended. Um... And I seem to have in my head that I learned from like way, way back when. My first ever Dark Souls playthrough was Pyromancer. Well, I had a mix of things. And I'm sure I read somewhere from some nerd who knew what they were talking about. Uh, oh, it's not ascended, it's upgraded. I had in my head it was ascended. Uh, oh, it is ascended. Right, so it's, um, they said Getting it to ascended is not as good as having it at plus 15 for some reason. The scaling actually goes down a little bit. So you need to have enough souls on you to get it to around about plus three uh, for it to be an upgrade. So we're going to need uh, 25 plus 27. Oh, let's do a hacking calculation. 
because we want this to go as smooth as possible. Um, I could be talking out my arse, but I'm so sure I read that. Plus 30. So that would get it to plus 2. So we need 82,000. And then if we wanted to get a plus 3, it's plus 30. 115,000 souls. Bloody hell. Okay, one, one. What's this? What's this? Damien, thank you for the sticker. Thank you for the two pounds. That's awesome. Thank you. GG. Look at me being good at video games. <laughs> Good oh, then. forgot my phone was on loud. Okay, we gotta go soul. We gotta go soul searching. <laughs> we gotta go search our soul. We're going to um, Jux. We go to Jux. Oh, I really wanna. Can we do egg? I would really like to do egg now. Work to Daughter of Chaos. It's really sad because the Daughter of Chaos bonfire is the one that you can warp to in Blight Town. Not the Blight Town bonfire. So, but it's hidden behind an illusory wall. I think that's so mean. I think that's like, oh, cause, cause imagine trying to get back to Blight Town, trying to go to Demon Ruins and Lost Isolith and not having this bonfire. You'd have to go, you'd have to go down the waterfall every time. The waterfall, the water wheel, every time. Right, Engie. What do I want? So purchase at the minute, we can't really buy anything from him because he like he trusts us, but he doesn't truly trust us, you know? Uh, so we have to go become Egg. Gotta protect the fair lady. That's true, that's true, but um, I just... It's just cruel, it's just unfair. Okay, so we're gonna, I think, keep our... Um... Yeah, we're not, we can't die. Because obviously we won't get egg if we die. We need a certain attack, right? This is how you get egg. And you'll need this if you want to get platinum. You need to be hit by a certain attack. So I took my hat off. You don't actually need to take your hat off. It automatically gets taken off for you, but I took my hat off. Um, these ones here are not aggro, but these ones down here are. So I'm just going to grab one of these. Oh, there's two. Mm, is this good? You can farm for double the attacks. Okay, so you're looking for. Wait, is it grab? Is the is it that? Is it the grab? Oh, it is the grab. That's it. That's the grab. So then, you get the kiss. You get the kiss from the alien. And then I think it's time based, but you like start getting like head lice. <laughs> and your character starts like itching their head. Um. Oh, it's freaking gross. I hate it. I hate it so much. Um, but yeah, we have egg. We have egg in brain. We have a parasite. Uh, just from th that grab. Uh, so we have to wait. Egg. We have to wait for that to happen. Uh, so what can we do while that happens? We can go and do... We did, we did ceaseless, didn't we? I usually do ceaseless on my first trip down here. Yeah, I did. I did. We can do... Oh yeah, I could do Demon Fire Sage. Ugh. Just while we're down here. Heck off. With what, sorry? There's an amazing... <gasps> There's an amazing Reddit post where... Oh, someone just asks, why is my character scratching his head? And then they followed up saying, WTF? Oh no, it's so funny. I love it, it's horrible. Brad, my DS1 character was called Egg, so this was perfect. Did you actually get the egghead? Did you actually, like, have the egg? Ugh. Who would choose to willingly have egghead? Yeah, oh, I hate it. I mean, I love you, but I hate it. <laughs> Thanks, I hate it. <laughs> I want to, um, yeah, I want to just have enough souls. So hopefully Demon Fire Sage does that for us. Have enough souls to buy everything we need off Engie and then I get rid of Egg forever. One seven eight. I guess it makes kind of sense that they would have some fire resistance. Kapara! Did you know about the attack? Brad or me? About the egg? I still never got to romance the egg. 
<gasps> Why would I do that? Why would I? Oh, there was a <laughs> there was a hole in the floor. <laughs> I never got to romance the egg in uh, Dragon Age Inquisition. I never did finish that. My tradition now when I start a Souls game is to call my character Egg. Did you play Elden Ring, Brad? Elden Ring! Sorry. Hello, Babe! Hi, Red! <laughs> Henceforth, I shall always be known as Babe. What Babe? The Babe with the power. I've got a whole multiverse going on. <laughs> I think JRH means like, did you know that you were gonna get Egghead? I think. I think, I think he means that, I don't know. Maths? Maths, Damien? I'm honestly worried I'm getting too into city skylines. There is never too into a game unless it's harmful, like gambling, like, like mobile games. There is, there is a, such a thing as getting too into a mobile game, for sure. I was very into Raid Shadow Legends at one point. Anyway, there's no, there's, there's, there's no problem. I see no problem. I see no problem. I'm spending time jetting walkable paths through as many roads as possible. See, that's cute! Like, that, that's gonna actually teach you life lessons, actually. Now, that's a game where you're gonna learn stuff about society and, and, and culture and things. I don't know. Oh, I could have got my Kirk invasion there. Ugh. Yeah, I just walked straight through that hole. <laughs> but babe, with Biff, the bower of the boo 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 boo, you boo boo, <laughs> the babe. I have egg in one, two, three, and demon souls. <gasps> Elden Ring, Elden Ring. Brad should play Elden Ring. It's so good. You should get it. I thought it was the way to fall again. Uh, these things are probably immune to fire too, huh? Would you <gasps> what do you think? Eggden Ring. Oh, the kick attack gets replaced? <gasps> I literally didn't know that. 77. 77. Uh, do I have enough pyromancy to... I think I do. I think I have enough. Like, Great Chaos has got to do decent damage, right? He doesn't sit in the lava puddle, though. Yeah, the lava doesn't get him. <laughs> Sheldon ring. Knock, knock, penny. Knock, knock, penny. Hey, lava! Oh, one tick of lava. Oh, when I finish Horizon, I'll start Elden Ring. I should finish Horizon. I should probably finish Horizon, huh? Yeah, Wormy Boy is- <gasps> Ah! Ah! I hate it! No! Oh, 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 I hate it. We have egg. Blah. Thanks. I hate it. <laughs> I have to keep it just for a little bit longer because I need, um, I need plenty of souls to be able to buy what we need to buy. Did I rest? Yeah, yeah. So we'll go do Fire Sage and then that should get me everything I need. <laughs> Wear me by brace your weapon if it, I think that's only if it spits on you. Try the kick. Uh, yeah, good point. Yeah, good point. We'll do that. Not not in the boss fight, though. You use paths to connect parts to surrounding s parks to surrounding streets. I knew that was gonna hit me. Right. Okay. Let's just get you handled. No, he's gonna keep doing the. Okay, butt job for me or something. Fantastic. Oh 
Oh my god, the, the flippin' tick is the best. Like, it just sits on the floor and if they stand at it, they take so much damage. Yeah! For a gamer! I love these big chunky bosses where you feel like you're really taking a big chunk out of their health. Like, Dark Souls 1 really, really has that feel of like just taking a chunk out of people. He was fire because he's covered in fire, but he's actually he actually does like magic damage, which is weird. And he takes a decent amount of damage from fire. It's kind of weird because he looks like he's fire, but he's not. It looks like Godzilla, but due to international copyright laws, it isn't. Still, we should run like it is Godzilla. No, it isn't. <laughs> Name that film. <laughs> Dave, I'm terrible at city management games, including the original SimCity, because I'm old. Oh! Out of my way. Okay, out of my way. Um, this is bad. This is really bad. If I die here, this is really bad. Um, nope. I'm gone. <laughs> awesome powers! Yes! <laughs> it's so good. It needs to evolve, and that needs a hundred thousand souls. What? It needs to evolve? I don't know that. Oh, I probably knew this at one point, but I have since forgotten all about this. So you do like, do you do like the egg grab instead of a kick? If you have evolved egg, you get a little worm inside your egg. Would you call Cult of the Lamb a city management? I guess it's a cult management. You do, you little wormy worm. I don't want it. No, thank you. I'm good. <laughs> I'm good. Thank you. I'm good. <laughs> there's a f there's a five minute delay, Damien. Really? No, that's too I put what I put low latency on. Hang on, let's test it. Let's test it. So if I say um, if I say sixty nine, you say. Oh, no, that was like, that was like 10 seconds. That was like 10 seconds, so. <laughs> uh, so I think Damien just needs to refresh. Nice, nice. I can see varying levels of lag here. <laughs> Vicky was like 10 seconds or something. <gasps> Gives me the egg vermifuge, which is what gets rid of the egg. What is it that you need? I would like to, because you trust me now, I'd like to buy. Toxic mist and another slot of poison mist. We've got a lot of poison now um, to hopefully try and take down the centipede demon. I have a funny feeling. I don't think it'll be enough, but I'd love if it worked because I'd love to not skip any bosses on a challenge run. Egg be gone. Wait, what happens if I just kick normally? Oh, that wasn't a kick. You just, you just, can I just not kick with a, oh, I just can't kick with a, with a glove. You can't kick with a glove, apparently. Oh, imagine, <laughs> imagine just throwing firebombs around in a room with someone very fragile. Sorry. Sorry. I'm not set up with my internet customs. Oh, it's a stupid meme. It's the guy that goes, nice. Or just, you just say nice when someone says 69. Because it's the sex number. The head is so gross. Yeah, I'm getting rid of it. I'm getting rid of it. I'm putting one point into, um, uh, into Vitaly. And then I'm getting rid of it. It's going, it's going, it's gone. It's gone. Say goodbye to Egg. It's gone. Okay, cool. Right, can I put my hat back on. Right, cool. Uh, we can now progress to Cytopee Demon. There's a bonfire in front of Cytopee Demon, that's fine. 
I swung my sword around her and I hit the servant guy. No! <laughs> no! He's such a little nigger though, like. He's so gross. He's minging. <laughs> he deserves to die. <laughs> I mean, bit harsh, but. You're just putting him out of his misery. Okay. Yeah, I'll rest of the bonfire. Change my spells over. My worry is I'm going to try without using Dust Crown Ring because I quite often clip the lava when I jump over the lava. Because I like jumping over the lava so I can fight him in a good spot. Uh, so get, just get rid of everything. We don't need anything. Just poison, poison, and toxic. Nothing else is really going to do any damage to him. Mm, we need big, big fire res. I guess for the lava. Lava's fired at a killed egg friend. There is only room in this large land for one egg friend. I don't need crown of dusk. That's actually going to make me take more lava damage, isn't it? We just need fire, fire death, right. 22, actually the gold hem black is really good. I feel, oh, I feel so bad because I like always use this freaking armor set, like for everything. I didn't pick up the dragon uh, shields, dragon crest shields. I always use this armor set and I feel like it's really boring because it's just, it's just too good and you get it so early. Um. Like, why would I not use it? Hello, Swiddles! Welcome to Dark Souls. We're doing uh, Pyromancy only. We're about to try Centipede Demon, who's immune to fire. So I don't know how this is going to go. We're going to try and poison him. Uh, let's, uh, yeah, let's try going over here. I always, always, one day I will do this without touching the lava. One day. I like need to like heal here because I always flip him. Okay. <clears throat> Will we go straight in with the poison? Yeah, we'll do poison first because toxic is the like more effective one, isn't it? Right, come over here. So it creates a cloud and then he has to like stand in the cloud for a decent amount of time. Do you not want to come over here, no? Am I? I'm like rolling super early. This is like lingering hitbox or something. Right, I could like... I'll come to you. How's that? Okay, there's a cloud. Touching him. Poison throwing knives. Yeah, they're not they're not pyromancers, so. Yeah, he's just missing all the clouds. Maybe because I'm targeting. Thank you. 
that's really cool. They do have high res. So I looked when I looked at the page for Quaylag, it said on her page has high poison res. So that's how we got Mildred to do it. Um I think we're just gonna have to get Solaire, guys. You'll never take me alive! Oh! Oh no! <laughs> Push me in the lava. Push me in the lava. It's fine. Yeah, I think we're just gonna have to get Solaire. Uh, I can't be bothered. But to be fair, it's my my challenge run, and I've decided that if we're allowed to use Mildred for Quaylag, then we're allowed to use Solaire for Zed Pete. <laughs> yeah, it's just yeah. Uh, oh god, now I have to put all my things back on my bars. Ugh, combustion, great combustion. Fire orb, great chaos orb, and fire with it. Wait, I've got another slot. Did I have another? Did I have another fire orb? Yeah, I have another fire orb. Okay. <laughs> More Solaire! Okay. Hi, Jordan! Welcome in! There's also this tricky get them to glitch through the corner and fall through the map. <gasps> that is technically pyromancy only. That is technically not using another weapon. That's that would work, <laughs> but it's tricky. I've never done that one before. I know the one you mean because I've watched like Lobos's uh, like glitch all bosses run and stuff like that. Hi Reaper. Hi M E D <laughs> D. What am I doing? Oh yeah, uh, humanity. Humanity. Oh the humanity. Welcome in, guys. Welcome. Uh, we're doing. Oh, I may as well kindle, eh? We're doing centipede, pyromancy only, and I've had one try at it and I'm already bored of trying to poison him. I just... He just jumps. He just jumps all the time. So, reverse hollowing, kindle, we're gonna get Solaire to do it. If I never talked to Solaire in Anor Londo... No, he is! I did talk to him in Anor Londo, yeah. I did. I'm pretty sure I did. I'm pretty sure I did? I don't see his sign though. Maybe it's just not loaded in yet. I'm pretty sure it's down here. If I'm wrong, you guys can just tell me because I don't I don't know everything. I thought it was meant to be down here. Maybe I didn't talk to him. Maybe I forgot to talk to him. Uh oh. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> It is meant to be- oh, at the door. Is he still gonna be there? Or have I hecked that up? Oh, I think I've hecked it up! Uh, uh, princess and then round and then up and then... It's a long run. Yeah, the fog door, yeah. I don't know, I've never like needed Solaire for centipede demon, so I don't, I don't know. Why are you just posting M's? <laughs> oh, you're pretending to be Zeke Meyer. Mm. 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 Oh, oh. <laughs> I think they coded this so that you just miss it when you run up to it. Praise the sun, hi sweetie. Reaper, I'm gonna ask you really nicely and politely, please to stop posting M's or I will time you out. Are you as well, sweetie? I there's no point in contributing to chat with just M's. Ugh. Yeah, JRH, can you time them both out, please? Thank you. So that's a timeout. You're not banned, but like you're welcome to come back in five minutes if you want to actually contribute. What a weird way of trolling. <laughs> I'm all for having a good time. Where am I going? I'm all for having a good time, you know? The M squad. I'm a fan of the letter M. I'm a fan of the letter D. <laughs> you know? Yeah, down here, we'll have to like go through the two nights. 
Well, that's okay. Thought I would save time not having to go through them. So like, I think he goes away as well. We have to we have to figure it out though. We have to find out. Hi Jason! Oh, I just pressed the flipping. Gone to find your video on the Hellkite Dragon and you're live! Oh my god, it's your lucky flipping day. It's your lucky day, Jason. Yeah, the oh, see once you do the the Hellkite like skip, you'll never do it the other way ever again. You'll like never go under the rats ever again. It's like so much easier. <gasps> Vessi boy, my good man. Hello. So, um, I, oh, I did mention I quite like to do all bosses when I do a challenge run, but obviously I've made a mistake here that is going to have to probably cost me doing a boss. I'm going to leave it in, like, suspense. And if we go through this door and the room is empty. <gasps> he's there! He's there! He's still there! He's still there! He's, ch he's waiting for us! Oh, the run is alive! <laughs> The run is not dead. Anytime you see my book, you left. <laughs> Thank you, Soler. Praise the sun! <laughs> the run is saved by Solaire. Uh, but yeah, I don't know if we have to talk to him like more. Uh, Togo. Talk. You really are fond of chatting with me, aren't you? If like I a big own. dad, I would think you had feelings for me. Hi, man. You really are. If I don't. Oh. Welcome back, guys. Welcome to How to Souls. We're doing Dark Souls Pyromancy only, which is... It had a really difficult start, actually. Uh, and now it's kind of difficult dealing with Centipede Demon. Uh, Bed of Chaos is going to be fine. Um, but yeah, Centipede. Wham, wham, wham. We need to make sure that Solaire stays alive. I think it's going to be the hardest part. <gasps> Hi, Gally! Oh, I've already got the Lord Vessel. You're going back there to kill it. Oh, you're going to kill it? Flip, yeah. Flip, yeah. I haven't done a how to kill the Hellkite Drake, Drake video. But the way I would do it is um, I would get him to flame the bridge so that he gets rid of them all. Like, coming up from the Undead Berg bonfire up the ladder, I'd get him to flame the bridge, kill all the hollows, and then I would wait until he came down. I would, um, I guess, try and stick by his feet and, and avoid the stomp rather than, like, being far away and risking the fire. I don't often kill the Hellkite Drake, actually. I think it's quite hard. Have fun watching Solaire run through lava. Oh, we're going to have to fight him at the front gate, aren't we? Because... <laughs> oh, come on! I hate the little meatballs. I hate them. All the good beans coming in! Doggo can have a question mark here as well, I noticed that. Doggo can be, where's the doggo? On YouTube, but it's just, where's the doggo? On Twitch. <laughs> so there has 99 resistance. Uh, I hope so. I mean, if he dies before he gets to Centipede, I'll be sad. Uh, so it's all saying you can cheese Hellkite from out of range using the Hawk Ring. Oh, and literally just, um... But not hit its tail, just hit like it's... Are we talking 900 arrows kind of thing? That's how I always kill the dragons in thingy, uh, uh, demon souls. Just arrows from very far away for a very long time. <laughs> okay, there, he should be over there. Can we see him? No, we still can't see him. Where does he move after Anna Orlando? Is it going to appear? No! YouTube in I know. I actually I actually have memberships now. Did I set it up? I was I made, I was going to make it 99p, guys, if you wanted uh emotes on YouTube. I can't remember if I set it up or not. There should be like a join button. It's up to you. Obviously, it's not like expected, but it's just if you want it. If you want it because I'm not going to be doing as many streams. Right, Reaper, get fucked, mate. <laughs> get get out of here weird hacking troll <laughs> sorry for swearing um i am flipping pmt i'm pmt uh, you can just you can just do that how do you how do you ban someone just get this person out of my life did i set it up 
GRH, can you figure that out? Can you figure that out to ban this child? Memberships. Uh, oh no, I had to make it 199. I wanted to make it 99p, but I had to make it 199, apparently. To do with payouts or something. Okay. Yeah, I did set it up. Cool. But yeah, I got emotes. Uh, 99p for a rate you bought. Did I put the bot on it? I've got, oh, I put all the Dark Souls related ones on. So I put um, hype and cheers and I put the attack, but like the white dog. Uh, and I put the Pope Turtle Love on it as well. <laughs> but I think once you get two members, it like unlocks you another slot. Uh, this is the next spot after Anor Londo. Mm, I don't think you would need to summon for ONS. So Lair should appear here after talking to him in Anno London. Anno London. That's weird. Where is he? Let's try a little reset. Must resist urge to post M's. No, um, sorry, but I'm really trying really hard here. <laughs> and I'm PMT. So I'm not in the mood for trolling, Brenda. Yeah, we're doing cheeky quit. We're doing a cheeky quit. Plus I'm like, <sighs> It shouldn't be that difficult to figure out how to ban someone. Gally, why are you not a mod? Now you're a mod. Hidden? Wait, they're just hidden? Wait, so they could just like, they could just like um, scream into the abyss? And no one can see it. That's like the best punishment. I love that. <gasps> you do, you have a spanner. You have a spanner. Look at the wrench. Oh, it's a wrench. Wait, spanner? Wrench? <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. I'm in a weird mood tonight. Right, okay. So, Solaire. Don't know where he is. Don't know what I've done there. Is it because we killed Demon Fire Sage? It's a tool. <laughs> It's a modification tool. Is it because we killed Demon Fires? I wouldn't have expected that. He can be at Sunlight Altar. Mod stuff isn't as intuitive on YouTube. Yeah, just the whole live streaming everything on YouTube just seems a little bit behind, doesn't it? Right, well I've rested again. I think we would be able to see the sign from here. There's a weird like dot that keeps dotting. Hi Wolfies! Hello! Hello, hello! Uh, I'm gonna... I mean, I don't have the 30 humanity. I think we need to just come back. Is he still there? I like exhausted his dialogue. He was doing the you must have feelings for me thing. It's worth a check though. Yeah, it's worth a check. We shall see. We shall see. Oh, your toilet adventure, Poshie. Eh? How goes the souls? Ah, uh, sorry. I feel like we've hit a bit of a wall. Which is, I guess, good because this challenge was not really much of a challenge. Like, since the, the first boss being, um, well, second boss, sorry, being Capra Demon, it's not been a challenge since then. Uh, so I guess it's cool that it's a challenge again, because that's fun, that's entertaining, it's it's fun trying to think of how it's done. Um, I'm just a bit, I'm just a bit like, oh, I just feel really uncomfortable on YouTube. I think I feel really unconfident, that's the word. I feel just really unconfident here, like, like I'm wasting my time. Please don't call myself a gamer. I would never, Emil. My name is Rach. Love watching you solve a problem, but Gally, my maths! <laughs> what the flip was that? It's alien. I know, so this is only my like third, yeah, third YouTube live stream. Which, like, if you think about how many Twitch streams you have to do before like being, like, knowing what's going on on Twitch. 
Get a different vibe? Yeah, lots of like kids here. I feel like I don't get that many like kids on Twitch. I don't call myself a gamer. Just a person. <laughs> Who's really good at Dark Souls and I'm like so much better than you. I'm so much better than you at Dark Souls, mate. <laughs> so much better. Wait, Wolfie? What is Wolfie? Um, is that Illidor? I forgot if your kid was Logan. I think YouTube streams are weird. Yeah, I think that is. I think it is Illidor. You know, you can. Um, YouTube keeps emailing me. <gasps> it is the sloth. <laughs> <laughs> well, welcome, pal. It's fun to try something different, don't get me wrong. I'm really sorry for moaning. I think I'm just getting my period and everything makes me angry. And I just want to stab everyone. He's still here! Okay, right. Okay, good news is he's still here. Bad news is he's still here. Still here. You really are fond of chatting with me, aren't you? If I didn't know better. I think you have feelings for me. Mm. Oh, dear me. Pretend you didn't hear that. <laughs> Why would he move? <laughs> move, bitch. Get out the way. <laughs> Not having so many wanes over on Twitch is a weird one with the perception of the platform being that it's all we guys playing Fortnite. True. I think just my channel in general and where it's positioned in the directory, i.e. 100 like CCV, just doesn't tend to get very many people coming in. Oh! <gasps> Wait, Fred F. Burger, you're doom so Oh my god, you're doom sock. Fred! It's so weird, like, putting people's, like, YouTube and Twitch names together. <laughs> Hiya, dooms. Oh, I quite often use the loo, but you don't hear me calling myself a pisser! Oh my god, I love you, Swirls. I love what to be fair, if you're friends with Red. <laughs> you need cookies and ice cream. I do, I actually have little mochi. The mochi ice cream, like mochi moons, but um, it's all the way downstairs and that's effort. My niece's cat started cuddling up to me in purring. <laughs> Maybe moving on from this hellkite fire breath is a one hit kill. Yeah, yeah. Off to find another golden dog. Get golden dog! <laughs> He'll move if you set him on. Oh no, I don't want him to be set on fire. I want him to move to Centipede Demon. He might move to Sunlight. Swiddles is flab. Am I saying it right? Is it meant to, is it like Swiddles? Doomsock and every decent variation was taken. So I put a random cartoon character. I like it. I like it. So we think we should check the altar. Yeah, we can check the altar. That's good. Oh, you guys calm me down. Fog gate. No, no, no. I prefer dog game. Golden dog. Oh, it is Swiddles, got you, cool. I like to check, you know, I like to check because there's some people that are too polite to tell me, like Stacy, I called Stacy Stack Yems for some time before realizing it was Stacy M. Yeah, I'm not a big fan of fighting Hellkite, so I, I'm with you. Poggies. Poggy, poggy, pog. Oh. I'm having an old man early night tonight. Oh my god, so poshy. Like, I'm doing this stream until 9pm. And then I'm going to bed. <laughs> I've been working since like... Half past eight or something. And I have had, like, very little breaks today. Or the tomb of the grave lord. But I cannot give up. But when I... What if I... Well... He's so good. He's so good. So because I was trying to go to Lost Isolith first, he didn't oh, move. You... Wait, hang on a minute, hang on a minute, hang on a minute. What was that? Oh, hello there. The sun is a wondrous body, like a magnificent father. Like a big His dad! So grossly a magnificent father is why in the in the um in the poorly translated edition, we all thought it was really weird. It was actually a it was actually a good translation. <laughs> The sun is wonderful. It's like a big dad. <laughs> Amazing. Oh, God. Love this game. Yeah, love an early night. It's just like sometimes you just need one. And then tomorrow... I don't know what I'm doing tomorrow. I might 
just get pitched and play World of Warcraft tomorrow. Or Disney. <gasps> Disney. Spooky Disney. But World of Warcraft, I resubbed. Well, I got Dragonflight. I got Dragonflight. And then it came with a one month um, uh, subscription. So technically I haven't paid the sub, but I paid for Dragonflight. <gasps> yeah, I've got a sponsored stream tomorrow. For oh, I was sort of thinking um, uh, it, like tomorrow evening. Like in my free time. My very limited free time. Uh, yeah, I'm playing Mario and Rabbids tomorrow. I'm excited to see how it is. It looks good. <gasps> I'm working from home tomorrow. Are you going to join? We're doing Elden Ring and Mario. Ugh. I've had two late nights in a row. Poshy. Sorry, playing. G oh, God, I love Genshin. I love Genshin. I, like, deliberately, I, I don't play it much because I think I would just lose myself to it. Pajamas all day in a fry up. Oh, you're cute, man. <laughs> I love, I used to, um, when I used to do animation, uh, I used to, when that was my first sort of like, I worked from home. It was, it, that was, this was like 2013, 14 kind of time. And it was a like, uh, it was a novelty to work from home. I'll have you know. Uh, so I used to call it pajanimating. I was pajanimating. when I was working from home. I familiarized myself with YouTube's mod controls. That's my girl. That's my girl. I really shouldn't let things like that get to me because that's what they want. They want to annoy you. They want to annoy you and I hate that it works, but I'm just so tired. I work so hard. Guys, can I be vulnerable? I work really hard and I know for a fact that what I make is friggin' great. Because you know it, I know it, and you know it, because you've got great taste. Um, and I know streams are great. Over on Twitch, anyway. <laughs> I feel like I don't know what I'm doing here. Um, but it's frustrating feeling like I'm banging my head against the wall a little bit. We got Solaire. We got Solaire. Mmm. <coughs> Oh my god, Wolfie is cat sitting too. So Wolfie and Fred both cat sitting. I played it ironically, but then the story got good. <laughs> I only did like the first like story area, like the first like dragon like encounter thing. It was like a big dragon boss and it was amazing. Uh, but then I was just like running around looking for a treasure chests and that. Jordan's restarted Mario and Rabbids Kingdom Battle. So Kingdom Battle is the first one. Sparks of Hope is the one we're playing tomorrow. Yes, we got him. He's here. We got him. So, uh, I think we literally just have to tank. Uh, like, I can tank and maybe punch. Although, technically, punching is not pyromancy. Mmm, technically. And we'll just see how much damage Solaire does. Yeah, I, I hear really good things about the original, yeah. So, I'm gonna block. I'm gonna, like, tank for him, basically. That went all the way through my shield. It was blocking it last time. Right, Solaire, I would really prefer if you didn't die. Oh, I would really prefer if I didn't die! <laughs> Hi, Nando! <laughs> uh, if my fist is infused with fire, it'll do no damage. <laughs> Yeah, so I hate fighting him there because he just stands there and he just does that again and again, which is why I quite like to go off to the side. Um, I don't know how you make him come closer, like how you would sort of tease him over. How are you doing, Nando? Welcome. Welcome to YouTube. I like it here. I don't love it here, but I like it here. <laughs> I'm not used to it. I don't usually like turn-based stuff, but it was good fun. And there's DK levels. <gasps> DK! Donkey go! I don't like that Genshin made seasons shorter. Can't keep up with all the content. Yeah, they want you to pay money so you can get all the best characters, eh? Good game, good visuals, good combat. But I've had to turn streaming mode on to hide the fat the chat. Cause my god, that community is hard. <laughs> It's got a streamer mode, I guess, for a reason. <laughs> okay, son boy. My content is entertaining and, and welcoming and lovely and helpful. Yes. 
I'm just tired. I'm really, I'm definitely PMT. Like, I feel everything is annoying me. Like, Centipede Demon is annoying me. I need to get this victory. Um, but yeah, no, we can't punch because it's not Pyromancy and we can't Pyromancy because he's immune. So, we literally just have to run this way and hope that he follows. Flash a little skin! Oh, hey, big boy. Right, come on, Solaire. Come on, Solaire! Yeah, he takes no damage from the from the, the stuff. Come on, babe! Come on, Solaire! Come on, where are you going? Come here! <laughs> Solaire! Come here! Come on, son! Now start throwing some lightning! He has poor lightning resistance, apparently, so... Right, he's gonna start hacking, isn't he? Yep. Oh, he's not gonna get any attacks in doing this. He's spamming! You're such a spammer! Okay, he's jumping now. Right, so there, have you not attacked him because I've not attacked him? Is that why? Just not doing anything. Right, look, I've attacked. There we go. Come on. Please do a flipping. No. No. I tried to block that for him. Where you've hit him once, you know it to die. I can't tank. I can't do any damage. He got eaten. Could that be poison toxic? No, well, like while he's in the eating animation, they can't be like hit, can they? But yeah, you're right. I should have kept the toxic uh, attuned and tried to build it up. He's in the lava again. I have to be the one to initiate. Yeah, I had to like, I know that now. I'm not used to like doing flipping passive mode where I don't do anything. I'm used to pulling my way. Yeah, I get the lightning. He missed. He friggin missed, man. Oh my god. Okay, well, we got a little bit closer this time to last time. Uh, no, summoning would be like more cheating, in my opinion. Thank you, though. Oh, I thought that would kill me. Zenobie Demon is worse than Bed of Chaos. <laughs> Really? Nah, not much is worse than Bed of Chaos, man. Let's have a think. I, when I said summoning, I meant like summoning a person. A person with a brain, as opposed to an NPC. Uh, wait, the servers! The servers are still down. There's no, there's no online. Dark Souls doesn't have online. Servers are down. Yeah, I think we put the poison back on. I don't know why I took it off, to be honest. I thought we were skipping. Poison. Poison. Toxic. Nice of you to assume I have a bring. You're welcome. I have, I have faith in you. They've still not fixed it. No. Uh, crazy thing about Dark Souls 2 is, Gally, obviously I've been playing Dark Souls 2. There's a walkthrough on this channel. It's really good. Uh, but there's still people who will just not think it's any good because I'm a woman. That's fun. Um, but yeah, it's really good. I forgot to be human. Um, and every time you start up Dark Souls 2, it's... Uh, it tries to connect to the server. There's no option to just not bother. And it takes, like, it sits for like three minutes or something trying to log in. And I'm like, no, stop trying. You're not going to log in. 
stop trying to make logging happen. It's not going to happen. And uh, I have to wait for it to time out and then I can log in. Uh, then I can like open the game. I love Dark Souls 2. I'm doing a Power Stance Maces build for my walkthrough because I think it's just a really easy way to learn the game. Use Sunboy as bait and breathe toxic on them. Yeah, that's what we'll do. I have no clue where we would find one of those. Certainly not Benjamin. <laughs> Paul is saying that Centipede Demon is tougher than Bed of Chaos, but it's not worse. You So you don't think Bed of Chaos is difficult? Hey, we should get some tier lists. That's what we should do. We should do some, uh, some How to Souls tier lists. We should have like most difficult bosses per game. And then like best bosses or like most annoying bosses. That could be fun. Because I really think Centipede is up there on annoying. I wouldn't say it's... I wouldn't say it's difficult. That flipping, that like, just that he just doesn't want to move. Like that's annoying, but... Yeah. And fighting in a pool of lava. I guess that does make it difficult. S tier. Yeah, gravity. Gravity is the hardest boss. Please teach me how to not take lava damage there. Bed of Chaos looks cooler. It does look cooler. Oh, yeah, we could have a tier list on, like, looks as well. Very important. I agree. Okay. Right, so you- wait, you need me to attack. Hopefully Poison Mist counts as attack, because I took off everything else. <laughs> I could punch it. Punch it, Chewy. Right, here he come. Here he come. Okay, right, so we wait until he's like not jumping. Is that the grab? Is that the grab? Oh, the friggin' poison mist takes so long to cast. And then so long to... Right, he's in it! He's moved out of it! <laughs> Jumping and swiping. Right, go. It sort of travels in a line. Get him poisoned! He's eating Solaire. Right, I'm out. I'm out and he's still not poisoned or toxic. I used to eat insulin again! Oh, kill me! Oh god, kill me. Punch him! Wait, hack it, I'm fisting him. I've never done fists only. Somebody followed me on Twitch! Look at my Twitch alerts! Okay, hey, look at me! Don't look at Solaire, look at me! Look at me! If he only would stick with the lightning, but he's determined to not. Wait! Wait, Sidepig has lost so much health! How did that happen? I 
wasn't looking, so I don't know if he was actually taking damage. No, he's immune to fire, guys. I can't punch him with my glove. He's immune to fire. Was he just slowly, like, ticking down? <gasps> Is warmth in this game? I thought it was only in Dark Souls 2. Yes! Is that in DLC? Yes, please. That's a great idea. Warmth is a great idea. <laughs> I mean, this is sort of working. <gasps> I misread. No! Are you about to tell me it is only in Dark Souls? No! <laughs> I was so happy. I was so happy, Swanos. <laughs> right, he's about to go down to his like 10% or whatever. <laughs> it's just in two. Aww. Punch him in the tail. It would actually be really bad for me if the tail came off. What do we think? Do we think just try again with Solaire or do we think just keep punching him for about the next 20 minutes or so? Only way to heal NPCs is miracles. I'm sure when you uh, when you drink an Estus flask it heals um, summoned players. Keep punching. Oh! You know I'm gonna die. You know I'm gonna make a mistake and die, right? I got two more heals. Punch his stupid little sad looking face. God, camera. Rocky music! Da da da! Da da da! I need to punch another 200 times. Oh, have you calculated it? Wait, we can actually count the one, two. There are two bars here. Is that is there ten bars? So is each like big bar like ten percent? Ugh, the camera went like in his tail there. Yeah, just a, an estimation. <laughs> I think it's on 20%. No, 10%. I think each big bar must be 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Surely it's a percentage. I've never, you know, I've never thought to like calculate it. Should we do punching only run sometime? It has 3,432 HP. But we need to know what the bars represent. Oh, you stomped on me. But you really sounds fun. That would be like a... We could do that on like a 12 hour stream or something. And we can maybe get three bosses. was impressive but like I guess it was hard because when you roll you like travel but I think punching only would be much harder I guess because it's less damage because ro the roll did like 11 damage before resistances it was it was but not as impressive as doing it blindfolded no hit with flipping punching only level 1 on a dance map yes Yeah. 
Does strength increase punching damage? I don't know. Black Flame? <gasps> Black Flame! In the DLC! Yes! Yes, that'll work! That'll work! If I die, which I probably will, because I'm going to end up getting bored. <laughs> I'm going to end up getting bored and distracted and die. Because uh, I've got no heals now. Oh, for f oh. Okay. I mean, I didn't. I, that wasn't on purpose. That wasn't on purpose. I thought I was safe. I thought he landed quite far away from me there. But never mind. Yeah, that's a really good idea. Yeah, Black Flame. Yeah. Oh, Evie was, Evie was lying out there this whole time. Uh, yeah. 260. Ah, nah. Now nah, we punched him for a little bit, but it got boring. That's not good content. Unless we're doing punching everything. I think there's a way we can do this with, with, with Pyromancy. Um, and Black Flame is such a shout. Uh, which part of the DLC is that in? I mean, we were going to go and do, um, uh, the Duke's Archives anyway. So... So let's just go do that. Evie plays Dark Souls blindfolded, one pod punching only on a Guitar Hero controller. Evie. <laughs> Playing guitar. <laughs> At least make it a challenge, Gally. They don't call him Gally the Chally. Runny. Boy. They don't. They don't call him that. <laughs> okay. Uh, Jukes Archives. Jukes Archives. Get the pendant. <laughs> they don't call him that. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. I'm in a weird mood. I really like shouldn't stream when I'm in these weird moods. Cause I end up just I finish stream and I have like huge anxiety that I was just a twat and everybody who ever loved me is never coming back again. <laughs> um Did I Did I uh, speak to Dusk. Oh, I did, of course, because I have the flippin'. Yeah, Crown of Dusk. I'm still cool. I'm not a twat. Stee was very great. Stee was very pleased to see that I was not a twat. He was worried I would be a twat. I don't think I have twat vibes. <laughs> I'm so glad you're not a twat. He's such a, he's, Steve is such a very unique character. No twats here. Oh, they were twats. M Squad was twat, twats. Yeah, they were twats. That's the thing, Swaddles. Like, jeez. We could have had a really nice time. We could have a really nice time. Just played Dark Souls together. We had a lovely time. <sighs> I was a bit, I was a bit mad at Steve. For, for feeding Brad so much wine. But I I talked to him, I was like, Steve. I was like, he's just a boy. <laughs> he's just a boy. <laughs> um and he was very understanding and he was apologetic and I was like, apologize to Brad <laughs> Everyone was all a little bit tipsy. <laughs> Don't say that to me! Say that to him! I put my shield down, didn't mean to do that. Nice. Great combustion is like literally, it's like over double normal combustion, right? It's so good. I wish I had two stacks of it. Oh my god, I don't know. I don't know why, I just completely forgot about Black Flame. And that is definitely casted with the, the glove, yeah? Definitely. It is a pyromancy. Yes! Similar to Great Combustion. A quick and powerful close range spell designed to break guards. 
Uh, eight uses, but we can double that with the crown thing. Found in a corpse in the chasm of the abyss. Okay, so we've got to do Artorias. But Artorias would be fine with uh, Pyromancy. That'd be fine. All right, cool. Um, yeah, I'm up for that. So we need that to do Centipede. We need Centipede to do... Actually, well, we could do... We could... We could do the Centipede skip with 30 humanity, which I don't have. Nah, okay. So, so this is what we're going to do. Nobody's Jordan. Yeah, get an early night. It tends to be like people are all getting early nights tonight. It's a thing. Have a good one. Thanks for hanging out. It's like a puzzle swirls. Yeah, so we have to like figure out the, the sequence of events that we have to do. Got it. We do this. We're going up to get that pendant. Uh, we can do Seath. Like, I am quite confident we could do Seath. We may as well do Seath. Just killed those boars. This is where I can- Yeah? Jukes Archives! <gasps> Forgot about that nerd. Remember giving 30 humanity? Yeah, remember when you had to go in the menu every time? Jeez. I do, Mick, I do. It's only 15 men are unstable. I could do it. Oh no, I'm on Switch. I'm playing on Switch because I started this run when I was in the hairdressers. Oh, I miss my Newcastle hairdressers so much because um, she was really cool. Like she was kind of like, kind of punky, like always had really cool hair. Um, and she just didn't talk. She like didn't want to chat. There was no really awkward like, um, a, like small talk or anything. She just wanted to do my hair, get paid, and leave. I mean, I left. She didn't leave. She didn't leave. I left. <laughs> but yeah, and it was so just like, because I, I'm so sick of the whole like, oh, so what do you do? So what's your job? And I have to, we have to do all that. That old chestnut where I have to explain. I thought to myself, like, oh, I should just make something up. Every time they ask, I should make something up. But I don't have the... When I'm sitting there, I just want to be totally relaxed. I love getting my hair done. I pay a ludicrous amount of money to get my hair done, right? And it's, it's, it's as much, like, the final result as it is the experience getting it. So, I just want to be comfortable the whole time. I don't want to be lying and stuff. Going anywhere nice on holidays this year? Exactly, and I have to be like, no, because I've just bought a house. <laughs> um, 11k, I'll be sad to lose 11k. I don't think I have a ring. I don't have a ring. Jows it being a foreigner, all I get asked is, comes to us America? <laughs> We're all living in America. America is wunderbar. <laughs> Don't get cursed. Uh, we shouldn't do with this. Oh no, this armor has like no curse resistance. Now that I think about it. Oh, if we get cursed, we get cursed. Hopefully we don't though. I never got Havel's armor. Oh, I'm gonna get this. Or I'm gonna miss this. Got it. Need lots of Titanite to level up future weapons. Yeah, I keep forgetting to pick up Pavel's armor. Yeah, yeah, so I need like decent curse resistance, but not too much like actual armor, because we do need to die. 20? 20 on the crown of dusk. Jeez, that's loads. Cool. Uh, 35 on the- Oh, the dingy stuff. The dingy stuff is really good. Bloodstained skirt. Couldn't save you from Lautrec though, could it? The lady that makes mine has a habit of going in full chat and sometimes cuts off a tiny bit extra if you don't stop her. 
Oh man. Oh Dave, I'm going to bed. Good night, Dave. Early beds, everybody. Use power within before you go in. <gasps> oh my god, Paul, that is big brain! To just die instantly. I think we're okay. I think if you get if you stand in the actual laser, the laser does a huge chunk of damage. But it's only the crystals that do the curse. So yeah, we're good. We're fine. That's a huge amount of curse res. Love it. I love how we're all strategizing on the best way to die. But yeah, power within that. Oh, I keep forgetting I have that. Maybe I should put it at like the front of my list. Okay, Duke's archives. Kill this nerd. Get his key. Oh, I keep expecting everything to be poorly translated. Uh, I don't think it matters if you rest or not, because you just you would be here anyway. You wouldn't go back to the other bonfire. <gasps> Horrible cutscene. Yeah. Horrible gameplay. I didn't think he was going to attack me. I thought he was trying to get past me. We'll deal with them later. The worst prison guard ever. Worst episode ever. Let me just uh, YOLO. I'm gonna yeet yoot myself. Uh, one, laziness. Two, I guess, spell casts. Uh, three, they can't climb ladders. Um. Be like mega lazy. I guess we could run down here and then like homeward bone back to the bonfire. Don't spill me. That would be mega lazy. I've got enough homeward bones. Just gotta turn this off. Pull the lever, crunk. And then grab this. Oh, she moved. Or we could just die. That works. <laughs> I mean, I got the key. That's a fast way to the bonfire. Uh, the key to free Logan. Oh, that's just on your way to Seath. Yeah, that's just on your way to Seath. Oh, but then you have to come back. Yeah, coming back, I guess, is the... Yeah, the dying. I mean, I meant to do that. I thought that the quickest way to save a homeward bone would be just to die. Yeah, plus now we're ahead of the two guards. Uh, usually, so if you'd come back up like manually, they would be like up here and they would be up the ladder or whatever. That was the strap. I should go back to speedrunning Dark Souls. I have I tried it once. I did it once ever. I got two and a half hours. I got to Gwyn before two hours and choked so hard on Gwyn. I died to Gwyn like three times. I was... <laughs> I was so nervous and I was like crying. I was so stressed. Um, but uh, but still, I think two and a half hours and it was 80%, obviously. But um, my first ever speed run of Dark Souls, I think was pretty good. I went to eat food. I had to answer the door, like my door went off and I was like, I'm literally doing a speed run. But yeah, my door went off or something. Right, I'm gonna kill this one because he's a pain. Uh, we've obviously got the bonfire down there. I'm gonna risk it because we haven't really done anything crazy. Uh, just go up here. Now at least this is turned. I think we're gonna have to kill this one because I don't think we can get out of the way. Also, this one at the end here, I think we have to kill too. Because they're just positioned right in the in a way that they're in the middle of the corridor. Okay. Nice. <sighs> Alright. Yeah, I'm going to risk not getting the bonfire, I think. Oh, I rolled way too early! I was like, crest shield, don't fail me. He had like a bot here of health. Wait, have I misremembered this? Did I miss? 
Did you always have to turn it twice? Am I am I am I losing my mind? Get a ring doorbell and if anyone comes to a stream you just tell them no. And my doorbell does ring. What does your doorbell do? <laughs> yeah, I know what you mean. The one with the camera and the Memories of farming for Trident. Same on uh, remastered for the platinum. I always get lost. Yeah, I think I forgot that you had to like turn it twice. That's what got me there. You do have to turn it twice. Because you can You can't get there the first time because it's turned the other way. Yeah. <laughs> Brain. Do you know how many times I've done this area? And I still sort of question it. Too many. Too many. Uh, I would like to kindle, I think. Uh, let's do that. One more humanity. Ten to nine. We didn't make huge, like, in-game progress, but we did a lot of puzzle solving. Lots of, like, lots of algebra, lots of trigonometry, you know? <laughs> also, it's kind of nice just to, like, breeze through here and not have to worry about Zeke Meyer and, and stuff like that, because we were doing that the other day. Wednesday. Yesterday? What is this week? What has this week been? Jeez! What the hell? I discovered Big Dad, that's true. We made leaps and bounds today. <laughs> like a magnificent father. And that's why people think that Gwyn is uh, Solaire's dad. I guess that's one of the reasons, but... I'm sure it's to do with, we were talking about the empty chest after Gwendolyn. Uh, which we also could have done. We could have done Gwendolyn. And we were like, I th I have in my head that like Vati or someone said, oh, that's meant to be for Solaire, maybe. Okay, can we get past the golden boy? The golden boy always makes me scared. Like, I could get this far, never dying, and easily die to golden boy here. Like, he just... Hi, Ginge! Yeah, you got spanner. You got spanner. Protect me from children. Because they scare me. <sighs> Jeez, that's late. Is that you just home? It's fine, though, because weekend, mate. You are a spanner. <gasps> got him! Just home, jeez. But weekend, though. But weekend. But weekend. And you have to get the bus. Ugh. We, um, we're good. We're good. We're doing good. We're on Seath. Uh, we did Demon Fire Sage, but we can't do Centipede Demon. But weekend. You got it! We can't do Centipede Demon because he is immune to fire. So we have been... Oh, I think we're going to get clams in here. I think we're going to get clams. Uh, Seath should kill them, though, hopefully. Yeah, we got clams. Oh, I couldn't even get up. I was just lying there. I was spamming the roll button. <sighs> That's annoying. I was like spamming the button. It should be better now though, because we have a fog wall now. I was gonna say it when Galley showed up, but we broke bread at the weekend, so it wasn't happening. <laughs> Plus, Galley isn't a spanner though. You love the little ice clings? You love the sound of me dying? I broke into his house and smashed his jewellery thimble. I mean, I'm not going to disagree. I'm not going to try and deny it. I need his soul. <laughs> I never claimed to be the good guy. I need his soul. <laughs> oh, Salad. <laughs> oh, it's been too long since I played Dark Souls 3. It intimidates me. I can't just stick on Dark Souls 3 for fun, you know? Can't just do that. I'd play Elden Ring, man. I'd 
play a good game. Dark Souls 3 is a really good game. It's a really good game. It's just hard. <laughs> is this the worst boss run in Dark Souls 1? Um, I think relative to where you are at the point in the game that Tauros Demon is the worst boss run in Dark Souls 1 because of where you are in the game. That and uh, Ornstein and Smo. But this is pretty bad also. But you're by the time you get here, you're sort of sort of used to Dark Souls pooping on you. You're like used to being pooped on. In fact, you expect it. So <laughs> Yeah, I think Taurus personally, I just have memories of just wanting to poke my eyes out and being like, why do people like this game? <laughs> um so we should get immunity once we get to the fog gate at least. I can't believe I got hecked as I was lying on the ground. Right. Okay, let's go! Did the crystal regrow? Crystal regrow. I'm not enough of a noob to know that the crystal regrows. When was the last time I died to see? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Didn't know that either. I Too many first tries. I know. <laughs> Right, we're busting out the big guns that can break combustion. Oh! Tickle the tentacle! What we like to do! Oh, he's, he keeps moving! <laughs> Get him! Oh, thank you, Swirls! Really lovely to meet you. Thank you so much for helping with the, the centipede stuff. <laughs> we'll see you again. I've definitely fought Seath multiple times trying to get his tail. Yay. Yay. And then if you can't get it, you have to throw. No, um, like Chaos. Flipping Chaos Firestorm. I probably should have tried to get the tail there. In my literal Pyromancer run. Because Chaos Firestorm is like the best way to get the tail, eh? I love Moonlight Greatsword, I love it so much. Ah, oh, I kind of wish I had thought to try and get the tail there. There will be another run um, that we do that will allow me to get the tail. Maybe like uh, Wrath of the Gods, maybe? That might be quite good to get the tail. Just like run in and poof. Am I intentionally going for Night Elf? <gasps> no! Do I look like a Night Elf? I play Night Elf in Wire. My ears, one of them's floppy. If only we had bonfire aesthetics. Yeah. Like a certain Good Souls game. Wow, take it back. No, it is good. It is good. Uh, wait, 60k? We need a 100k for the Ascended Flame. Let's keep the 60. We're going to, now we're going to a uh, DLC. Uh, we're going to a said little, little, little guardian. Uh, Paddish. Unless there's like another easier boss we could do to try and get some souls. Cause I'm heading to the DLC so we can do, so we can pick up black flame so we can do centipede. We could do, Four kings. Four kings might not be too bad, actually. They're going to be a lot easier once we ascend the flame, though. Uh, Priscilla? Uh, Priscilla? Actually, great, uh, great combustion. Should get Priscilla's tail. Yeah, let's go do that. Haddish? Isn't that in French? French? So, Anna Londo. And then I'll run down. 
Not Lord Ran. Ah, I knew what you meant. I was expecting a GRH joke. I, I filled in the blanks. Just Dion asking about the cultist poster. I'm so excited to start making that. I've just been doing it alongside the edits because as I'm editing it, every time someone makes a new cultist, I take a screenshot of them. So it's going to take a while. It's going to take a few weeks. But that's the best way to do things like this, I think. Like things that are not like, um, well, in the nicest way, things that are not going to pay the rent. Um, Although you never know, I might sell a hundred of them. That would be cool. Maybe it'll be pretty enough. I promise it'll be, like, pretty gorgeous. Like... Anyway, I have to prioritise. I've got the... I, mm, I, I don't know, Ginge. I think what I need to do is I need to start, like... Putting them all on the page. See how many there are. And... Like, for size of the text the names and stuff like that. I th where where am I going? Painted World. <laughs> uh, I don't actually, I thought about doing it like in a circle. Like in a circle with the lamb in the middle and then an outer ring and then a middle ring and then an inner ring. Kind of like a few like rings. Um, Cause then I can do a kind of like, we could have some tentacles around the outside um, and maybe like little poops just dotted about. <laughs> What else is Cult of the Lammy? Because tentacles and poops. Uh, hearts. Little, little, little crazy hearts. Maybe some fish. Like in the background. Yeah, I think that's... That was the only idea that I had. But if there are not enough people or too many people, it might not work. Circle with praise the sun, but culty above. Then all... Then all cool culty stuff. <laughs> Overlord style. Overlord is in like Is that like a I know it's a film, right? Or do you just mean like my lamb is the overlord? Yeah, the names are a challenge, yeah, yeah. I think they're just gonna have to be quite small. But the poster's gonna be A3, so let me think like what size A3 is. It's like um it's big. That okay. Um, yeah, it's gonna be in like 300 DPI. I might have to make it higher pixel density just so it's got like big detail on the print. Um, and I get it printed from Moo.com, so like they're really, really good printing. So I think you'll be able to read them. So you know, um, when I did the posters for the PP partner party, and I put everyone's names on it, the names were actually really small, uh, and they actually come out in the print like really well. So. Oh, this could be a challenge because I don't have enough spells. I think we're going to have to do this in a couple of stages. Um, let me think. Like, we can't go straight to Priscilla. So I don't have enough spells to get there. So we're going to have to do it the pleb method. And actually, like, open the shortcut and stuff. <laughs> Not sure if this is my favourite area, but this might be the best area. <laughs> best. Worst. Hardest. The way they fit so much in such a small space is so good. I like the whole, it's a maze. Yeah, I do like that. It's fun to explore. And then plus there's friggin, there's friggin bone wheels here. It's such like hackery. I'm here for the hackery, yeah. Okay, I might try and run past you guys though. No? No, we'll take our time. Relax, don't do it when you wanna go to it. Wow, you missed me, but I got you. <laughs> I played some on Tuesday and Blighttown demoralized me. Oh, really? I mean, I do have a walkthrough. I literally do have a walkthrough, but I get it. Not everybody wants to. Yeah, going in the front door of Blighttown is, it's meant to be, it's rubbish. It's absolutely rubbish. This is 
the first level they made producing the game. Yeah, because it feels very Demon Souls-y. I mean, well, look at the phalanx. Wait, there's some phalanx missing. Where'd the phalanx go? Where did all the ph What? I've never seen this. They all have just left. They disappeared. But yeah, this this level, this area feels very Demon Soul, so that makes sense that this was the first one that they designed. They maybe didn't. What? Well, there they are. Yeah, on the switch. Phalanx just disappears on the switch, apparently. <laughs> okay, we're heading down the well. Whoa. And it has a Demon Souls invasion. <gasps> Wait, don't tell me, don't tell me, don't tell me. The butcher, Mildred. Oh wait, I didn't want to go this way. No, I want to go the other way. This way sucks. I thought you only played Disney now, Jin. What about Disney, Ginge? You're always on Disney. On that Xbox of yours. I don't know if it's is it this way and then down the... No. Yeah? Yeah. The invader has one of the best weapons. Oh, the butcher? Oh, oh wait, you're on about, oh, you're on about Xanthos. You're on about Xanthos. Wait, so Mil Mildred is a, a reference to the, the red phantom from 1-1. One, one. And Xanthos is the friggin' old monk. Ah! What about that? Okay, they can be one shot, that's good. King Jeremiah. Oh, I always had in my head it was called Xanthos. That's what the helm is called. But the NPC is called King Jeremiah. Got it. Okay. There's no other way to do this. I cannot just run through this area. It's too scary. I've got a really nice bright monitor, so like I can see them in the, in the distance. <gasps> Hi, Sparta! Thank you for lurking. My normal browser chat still doesn't work. It's so weird. There is. A oh my god, this is so funny. There is a, just a little phalanx just fell through the floor, apparently. my life. <laughs> it was worth it because that was quite funny. Bone wheels, man. Uh, to be fair, I should have known. I shouldn't have, I shouldn't have, did I not rest there? Didn't rest. You should have seen her face when she loaded it up and Scar was on the screen. It's been 11 years and I've never seen her that half. Oh my god. Cute. I want to sit in a room wearing Udi's, drinking rum, eating pizza, and playing Disney. Just Kirstie and I, just two screens, just two bitches, romancing Disney characters that we really didn't go to plan. It didn't, to be fair, I let my guard down. <laughs> Come down. I will. I will. Mr. Mr. Steel, your girl. We'll have to do that over again. Oh my gosh. <laughs> it was really annoying. Right, we just take this slow and hope that no phalanx fall through the- We cannot die. We cannot die because I need those souls to level up my pyromancy glove. No dying allowed, it's forbidden. Heck! Okay. Another one. Right, and we know when we went over there to fight that guy that another one got pulled. So, wait, there's one back there. Let's get this one. 
Okay, he's coming, he's coming, he's coming. Oh, sugar, I rolled. I hope I didn't just pull the other one. I didn't. Oh, I did! Okay, I was ready for it. I was ready for it. Good adventure! Good adventure. Was that the last one? Not sure. It looks like it. Oh no, there's one there in the in the light. I can dimly see, but I think we're okay. Oh, we got a little got a little scratch there. May as well grab this. So the proud knight. Proud. This is one of those really really obvious illusory walls. There's the door. It's Priscilla. I hate that it's down here. God, you have to do so much exploring to like, oh God, to find that. Cool. I don't need to go that way. Nor do I want to. Don't need to, don't want to. I said stream was only going to be two hours. It's been two hours, but we'll do Priscilla. I'm going to try and get her tail. Her tail is so hard in New Game Plus. So it'd be really good to, I mean, Seath is also really hard in New Game Plus. So it'd be really good to get at least get Priscilla's. Uh, I'm gonna rest, I think. Get my combustions back. We can try and get the invasion, but I don't think I will be able to <laughs> to kill him. <laughs> because fire. Why are they Oh, so um, a big, a big, um, the bosses get a big boost to health. In New Game Plus. Like, not so much like Elden Ring New Game Plus is not that bad. It's like like 1% more or something. But in Dark Souls, it's like 20% more or something crazy like that. It's like, it's same. Um, they have lots more health, so, which means like the tail has more health. Priscilla's tail ruined my last Knight's Honor attempt. Oh, but I guess. Oh. Uh, I guess you could just get someone to drop it for you. No online. Grim, yeah. So. If you're like me and you're planning on doing a run with every single weapon in the game for the crack because you want to get good and also because it's fun you should probably try and optimize getting these things on new game i'm gutted that i missed out on seats uh right and also i'm getting shot in the back again and again heck <laughs> Okay, but yeah, I think a great combustion. We'll do like a, a power within great combustion. That should get it. We have to hit it on the tip. That's important. Because um, if we hit it at the base, I don't think it breaks off. So let's give it a go. I yes! Bitch! Ready. Why does he hurry toward thine death? Beautiful. Beautiful. All right. Okay. she came back to life uh, to, to, to vision you never do that she kissing why do you never come back to, to life around me before it's when I'm doing other runs <sighs> it was so simple oh I'm sorry Mick what secret thing that was great that went really well. She even came back to life. Maybe you just have to do enough damage to her quick enough? And that makes her come back to, to, to vision? To vision. What? Help me with the, my words, guys. Helps her become visible once again. <laughs> this land is peaceful. Its inhabitants kind. I know I miss Manor Unstable. It was peaceful and then I got here. <laughs> Okay, uh, oh, I'm still ticking down. Uh, my health is still ticking down. Let's, um, oh, I got my 100. I need 115k to get the plus three glove. Let's do Gwendolyn. Let me do Gwendolyn. He's right there. And I can rest at his bonfire to get my spell cast back. To get my great combustion back. Wait! Great combustion, chaos fire. Oh, it's my, uh, my power within, to get my power within back. 
Oh, it's like a poise break that brings her back. That makes sense. Whereas like normally if I'm hitting her, it's like once every now and then and it's not enough to, woo, not enough to break her poise. Oh my God, good point, Paul. I could just like break some souls. I was wanting to use the boss souls to make the boss weapons, but I don't need to do that on this run. Like I can do that whenever, right? Yeah, we could just do that. Although I'm here now. <laughs> I'm here now. And Dune. We can't work to Gwendolyn, can we? Oh! Yeah. I think we can only work there if we are part of the Covenant, right? Mm, I really don't know the answer to that one. I know that you can only respawn here if you're part of the Covenant. I think so. You think? So we need the ring. Why did I? No, I should have killed Thingy first. <sighs> Gone the wrong way. Hmm. Because I'm pl pretty sure Dark Moon. I remember, like, my my photo memory remembers seeing something Dark Moon on the list of places you can work to. Oh well. Uh, we go back up and then we go. We have to go back to the princess anyway. That's fine. We'll go this way. Just go for a little jaunt, a little stroll. I am still streaming. <laughs> it's quarter past nine. Uh, I was going to try and keep these to two hours because I wanted to. There's a lot of people viewing these after they're live. Hi, that's really cool that you enjoy it. Thank you for watching. It's really cool. I've not really been myself today. Been a bit tired, but um, the quality of the gameplay. It's, uh, it's, it's pretty good, you know? Pretty good at video games. <laughs> So yeah, thank you. Thank you for watching. So I thought to myself, right, I'll keep them. I'll keep them two hours so that it's not like you don't want it to be like this long. I mean, that's already a really long video. <laughs> yes, people in the future deserve head pats. I think I clicked the box that saves the chat as well so they can see like what I'm responding to and they can see you head passing them. I think. Okay, so Thingy Mabobber is in the Blight Town. She is in the Blight Town. Let's see what we've got here. Let's see if we can make up to 115. Hello, future! Oh, yeah, almost 111. I have so many souls. I feel nervous having this many. 115k! Alright! hard to watch me die and lose them all. Right, rusted iron ring, don't let me forget. <sighs> when are we doing more Dark Souls poorly translated? Next Monday? Or maybe Tuesday actually because I think Tuesday is better for Zeno because I need him to, like basically for me to play Dark Souls poorly translated. Uh, Zeno just can't go on his Steam at all. <laughs> like he can't, he can't play anything. Cause we're family and we do the family share thing. He's my cousin from Somerset, and uh, because it only works on Prepare to Die, and I don't have Prepare to Die. If I had the ability to buy Prepare to Die, I would on Steam, so I can mod it. Floppy souls, though, that was just God's gift. What is funnier? What do you guys think is funnier? People that saw both. Um, and if anyone is watching this just from How to Souls and you want to see um, the floppy souls highlights, they're on my YouTube, my other YouTube channel, which is Don't Rage Quit. It's in the description of this video. 
I have got a highlight reel from the funniest parts of Floppy Souls. It's pretty hard to top. Yeah, but, but, there's been some quality memes coming out of poorly translated. I just, just something about just the, uh, oh, I have it on already. Just something about the whole, like, just, just, you never know when someone's just going to randomly come out with, like, nonsense. Ah, oh, thank you, Jerry. Well, that's Twitch. That's, that's Twitch. <laughs> I was talking about YouTube, um, because I've got a Floppy Souls highlight reel on there. Uh, and I have a poorly translated highlight reel coming. Uh, it's actually waiting for me to watch it. Truth be. Uh, this is definitely. Yeah, this is definitely putting it up, yeah. <laughs> I got nervous. Yeah, and you can see, look, you can't see, but look, it, the flame is bigger. The flame got bigger. Right, so, got it plus two, got it plus three. Oh, wait, wait I got it plus four? No, got it plus three. Got it plus three, right. Um, now go, whatever you do, yes, my time. <laughs> and if we want to get it higher, it's like another 100k or something. Uh, where is it? Don't by me, just slowly dying. Uh, so it's at plus three. So we need another 76,000. In total, you will spend 340,500 souls to get a pyromancy glove to the top level. That's insane. Like the, a weapon would cost you about like 10K or something. <laughs> All right, we got the upgraded glove. Very nice. I wish it like glowed brighter. That would be cool. But no, it's just a little, just a little hand glow. Little, little girl. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Let's go back to the bonfire. I seem to still be streaming. I don't know. Just the the chat. The chat is good. The stream is good. <gasps> Hi, Em! Bad translations. I think, I per personally for me, like, as someone very, very easily amused, I think it's the bad translation for me. It's just because you never know what you're going to get. Like, floppy souls, you kind of always expect it to just be like... Like, you kind of know that it's going to be, like, wiggly and I'm probably going to be, like, doing weird, like, flips and stuff. But then you never know when an NPC is just going to go, like, like the female undead merchant. If you don't buy something from her, she goes, shit. <laughs> it's, oh, man. Or, like, Patches going, like, you look stupid. <laughs> oh. Twin humanity is becoming men are unstable and the right of kindling becoming job offers. What was it? Small person? Was small person like one of the embers? I was crying laughing at job offers like. <laughs> the flop was funny but it was like the same funny the whole time. The funny longevity was not as high. Right. But poorly translated, it was constantly new funny. Yeah. <laughs> it's all good funny. Right, we got the glove. Uh, now we do, well, now we can do Gwendolyn. With the upgraded glove. Oh, not a big person, that was it. Do you, do you remember what ceaseless discharge was called? It was something about the office is not there or something. Bad mother was the mask of the mother, yeah. Bad mother. <laughs> <laughs> what was the album? Wait, you had Bobby and the Bobby and the Boys was an album title. Now we have uh, Tasty Job Offers and Bad. What's Tasty? Was Tasty a uh, a weapon? I think it's the office is not there. Yeah, because we were like ring ring hello, it's not there. <laughs> oh, Pinwheel was called Tasty. Oh yeah. <laughs> Also, uh, Dragon Slayer Ornstein and Beautiful Craftsman. <laughs> well, you don't have to get another one done, but like, if you are feeling creative, that could be funny. Mm, yeah, I don't think we can rest to the... <gasps> Warp to the Dark Magic! We can! Oh, yes, Paul! Yes, Paul! Cool, I'm excited to 
Gwyn Gwendolyn. Win Win Gwendolyn's heart. <laughs> okay, so let's uh, power within. I think great combustion we could get two in, and that might actually be better than great chaos. We could try both. Because uh, great combustion, I have to run right up to him, I guess. Need to go be an adult and get presentable. I despise shaving. <gasps> Good luck, Ginge. Looking forward to pics with Dapper Ginge. If you could stop doing that spell, that'd be great. Yeah, do that one. Man, wow. He literally melted. He did, like, died in lava. <laughs> Jeez. Nice little 40k. We only need another 30k to get the final ascension on the thing. Can you dual wield the glove? Yeah, but, like, you can't, like, power. You can't, like, dual. What's the word? You can't power stance in this game. You can give something to the crow. Can you? No, you can give the glove. If you give the glove, I'm sure you get something. No glove, no love. Have glove get melted. <laughs> Wait, no glove, no love. That sounds like a condom advert. And then you saying, have glove get melted, is a bit interesting. This bonfire should go out when you kill Gwendolyn, if you think about it. Is it two or three that has two different versions? The one that has the dark version, yeah. There's like one that like scales off your, your level of hollowing. I think three. I want to say it's Dark Souls 3 has the like dark glove, yeah. And it scales off of how hollow large you are, like uh, like how how ugly you are. <laughs> I want to say that's three. Two, I... Wait, it could also be in two as well. Dark pyromancy glove. Is it in one? No, I don't think it's in one. Okay, we are now up here. I'm what I'm looking for brass lady. We need to we need to go up one more. Is it it's two! Oh So my guess is that it scales off of um your faith and in I'm so sure there's one in three that scales off of how hollow you are, but I could be wrong. <laughs> I don't know a lot about three, to be fair. So it was you, was it? How dare you produce a blade upon a deity? Did she roll? Did oh no, she's buffing! I let her buff! What a noob! But how? This Oh, one hit! One hit! She was so, she was all talk, like. <laughs> oh, she was so giving it all this. She was giving it all this. Get wrecked, pal. She didn't buff enough. She should have buffed with fire resistance. <laughs> it's so dark. Do they still have the little imps when it's dark or do they go away? I never opened this door. Oh, I never bothered, did I? I was like, I won't need this. I won't need to open this door. Oh, we have the, these guys here now. Do I one-shot these guys? Do you have shield? Ah, oh, they have a shield. They might block it. Five! Five thousand! 
sind. <lacht> wow, this is unfair. This is too good. This is too good. The dark raids in the ruins before the four kings have like the dark hand. Yeah, they do have the dark hand because if it grabs you, it takes a humanity from you. Yeah. Boulder Knights. What, in the paddish? You mean them in front of the, they're, they're like uh, some dark, they're meant to be some dark moon uh, covenant like members. They're protecting Gwendolyn from you, I think. I think. <laughs> uh, where can we go now? Where can we go now? What have we not done? We've done... I'm thinking of optional bosses. We've done Butterfly, Priscilla, Stray Demon. Mm. Damn, like my cooking overcooked them. Hey, we sure heckin' did. <gasps> There's hydras and stuff. Uh, DLC. Four kings. I do want to keep going, but also I don't want to. I don't want. To, I don't want these videos to be too long. So I think we'll call it there. I think we'll call it there. Next time we're gonna get the flame to the highest level. We're gonna do four kings. We're gonna do four kings. Dispatch them pretty quickly. Uh, we're gonna do sanctuary guardian Artorius. That's gonna be an amazing stream. Don't miss it. Turn on the notifications, click the bell, and all that sort of stuff. Subscribe, um, Artorius. And then we get the Black Flame. Then we will get revenge on the Centipede Demon. Oh, that's gonna feel so good. The weirdest boss to find difficult, Centipede Demon. Like I think, like it's just such a people forget he's a thing. Like, like you forget the Centipede's in the game. <laughs> will the Four Kings last longer than the PM? No. I mean, yeah. I mean, that's not hard. I mean, can regular, can the regular Pyromancer buff the plus flame? I don't think so. I think it has to be Quelana. I think it has to be Quelana. Or maybe she's the only one that can ascend it. But no, I think it has to be her. <laughs> I can't believe the lettuce, you know, the Daily Star, the lettuce thing. I can't believe they were right. The lettuce lasted longer. Yeah, okay, cool. We got some big bosses and then if we blaze through all of that, then we will do a bit of chaos, uh, get the the little light, the little light torch light, headlight. We'll do the catacombs, we'll do the Tomb of the Giants, uh, and we'll do Manus, Calamite, and then Gwyn. I feel like I'm forgetting someone. Who am I forgetting? We'll figure it out. We've done Sif, by the way. We'll figure it out. Right, thank you very much for hanging out with me, guys. Uh, people in the future, you get head pats, you're great. Uh, once again, subscribe. I do lots of things. I'm doing a Dark Souls 2 walkthrough at the minute, so I hope you're enjoying that. I've done Sif. <laughs> people in the live chat, thanks for keeping me company. It was really nice. I had a good time. Thank you. Uh, I'll see you. I don't know when next time will be. I'll let you know. I'll let you know. Bye.